Hey there, this is Silent Jess. Sorry for the long wait. I've been having a busy life lately. I've been my mother's cat had uh, kittens, and I've been dealing with that. Then I ended up in the hospital for a bit. But oh well, that's life. So let's get down to business and teach you guys and gals on how to play uh, Beyond the Sun by Shine Down. So first things first, let's start off with the tuning. So the tuning is going to be. C sharp or step and a half down from standard. So our sixth string is going to be C sharp. Fifth string is going to be F sharp. Fourth string is going to be B. Third string is going to be E. Second string is going to be G sharp. And first string is going to be G or C sharp, I mean. So once you get that down, let's get down. Let's get on with the lesson. Okay, first we're going to go off with the intro. And there is a reason why I'm holding my guitar like this, and soon you'll see why. So first I'll play it to you, then we'll go over it. Okay, now let's get started on the intro, which is probably the most pain in the ass part of the song. So, we're going to be starting on uh, E minor over B. So, we're going to be having our index finger on 6th string 7th fret. Our middle finger on the 5th string 7th fret. And our pinky on the 4th string 9th fret. And we're going to be playing that as 6th string string and fourth string down to second then hitting the sixth string and doing an upstroke from the second string up to the sixth while muting the fifth string so then we're going to be moving over to G over B so we're keeping our index finger on the 7th fret. Then we're going to be having our ring finger on our 5th string 10th fret. And our pinky all the way over on the 4th string 10th or 12th fret. And doing the same uh, tempo. 5th, 6th, and 4th down to 2nd. And this time we're just going to be playing the fifth and or four, sixth and fifth string down up, then moving our index finger over to the eighth fret, making it a C over C major nine, and we're going to be playing the sixth string down to the fifth, then moving our pinky over to the tenth fret, and just hitting the sixth string to the fourth. And move down again, and upstroke with second and the third string. Then moving over to our A sus two, which is our fifth string or uh, sixth string uh, fifth fret. Ring finger on the fifth string seventh fret, and our pinky on the ninth string or. Fourth string, uh, ninth fret. And we're going to be hitting the sixth string down to the second while meeting the third, third string. Then moving our pinky over to the seventh fret and down strum again, plucking the fourth string and an upstroke on the second string up to the fourth. So it plays like. Then we're going back to our E minor over B. 
doing the same thing. Fifth, or sixth, fifth, and bringing our fourth down to the second. And then six. Second string up to the sixth string while muting the fifth. Then going to our G over B. Fifth, or sixth, fifth. And fourth down to second. Then hitting the sixth and fifth string two times. Down up. Move your pinky or move your uh, index over to the eighth fret. To your C major nine. Down strum. Then move your pinky over to the tenth fret. And hit that power chord. Down, down, up. And we're going to be ending on the ASUS too. And that's how you play the intro. Okay, now let's play that slowly to make sure you get it. Okay, and now we're on to the verse. So, chords for the verse are going to be E minor, G6, so a G power chord with open strings on the bottom, and A9, so A power chord with open strings on the bottom. And this is how the verse is going to be played. So the strumming pair is going to be so. It's going to be down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, up, up, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, up, up, down, up, down, up. And that's going to be repeated four times throughout the verse. But once you get to the A9 chord, it's going to be downstroke with all strings, then another one. Then on the third time, you're just going to be hitting the sixth string to fourth. Then an upstroke with all the strings. Then hitting another power chord, sixth to fourth. Then you're going to do another upstroke from first to third. Do a pause, upstroke on all the strings. Then you're going to be doing a downstroke with the sixth to fourth string. So another power chord. Then doing upstroke from the second to fourth string while meeting the third. Then another downstrom with the sixth to fourth string. And then another upstroke from fourth to or second to fourth while muting the third. And that's if you want to be really nitpicky. So. Okay, so let's play that all together nice and slowly. Okay, and now we're on to the pre-chorus. So the chords for the pre-chorus are going to be A minor. 
B. E minor. E major. And D6 over 9. C major 7. And B flat. So the pre chorus is going to sound like this. So the strumming pattern for the pre-chorus is going to be pretty similar to the verse. So starting our, on our A minor, down, 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 up, go to your B, down, 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 up, now off to our E major, or E minor I mean, down, down, and then third down stroke is on your E major, down, and up on your E minor, down, up, up, down on your E major, and up on and an upstroke on your E minor. That's probably the most challenging part of the verse or pre-chorus. Then back to your uh, A minor, down, 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 up, over to your B, down, 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 up. Then over to your D6 over 9. Down, 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 up. C major 7. Down, 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 up. B flat. Down, 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 up. Then we're going to be putting our index finger on 4 string 5th fret. And you can do this a couple of ways. The way I do it is I put my finger on the 5th string 7th fret and my ring finger on the 6th string 7th fret. Then go to slide all the ways up to your 6th uh, string 3rd fret and to the second string so but you can also do it like this and just bar it with your ring finger bar the seventh fret with the ring finger I mean if uh, if that makes it easier and that's strumming pattern for the pre-chorus okay now let's play that slowly Okay, and now we're on to the chorus. So since the chorus is played in heavy distortion, I'll show you how to play it like that, but I'll also show a way to acoustify it. So anyways, the chords are going to be E5, G sus2, G, C sus2, C5, a sus2, A5, D over F sharp, and B5. Okay, so first I'll show you how it's played on record.
So if you want to play it on acoustic and give it a little bit more of a acoustic flavor, uh, this is how I play it. And I guess I'll show you guys how to play it like that. <laughs> okay, so the way I play it acoustically is I start off with my E minor. So I go down, 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 up. Go to my G sus 2. Down, 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 up. Now I do an upstroke on a G chord. Then I go all, all the way up to my C sus 2. Then to my C5, down, down, up, then to my A sus 2, then A5, down, down, up, and I do it all open. Then back to my E minor, down, 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 up, D over F sharp, down, down, up, and I slide on the upstroke. Up to my A C sus two down. Cut my A sus two down, down up, and to my B five down, up, down, up, and that's pretty much how I play it. Then going back to my A minor down, down, down up, C sus two down, down, up, up. Down, 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 up, down, 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 up. Back to my E minor. Down, 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 up. D uh, over F sharp. Down, down, up. Slide on the upstroke. And end off on a C sus too. And one thing I found by found out by accident is when I'm doing my C sus two, since my pinky is laying right over the natural harmonics of the third or first uh, to third string, gives it a little bit of a neat sound. But that's just my take on it. You do you. Okay, since the verse, pre-chorus, and chorus are pretty much going to be the same, we're not going to really go over that, except for at the end of the second chorus, instead of being ending on a single note on a CSS2, it's going to end like this. One, two, three, four, then down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. So, all together... And it's going to go out over to the rhythm of the guitar solo. So let's head off to there. Okay. So the chords during the rhythm of the guitar solo are going to be E5, G5, F sharp 5, A5, B5, D sharp 5, E5 on the 7th fret. And, oh, let's go over the rhythm. Okay, so the rhythm of the guitar solo is going to sound like this.
Okay, now let's go over and how do you play the rhythm over the car solo. So we're going to go to our E5, down, down, meet the strings, down, up, G5, down, down, meet the strings, down, up, F sharp 5, down, down, meet the strings, down, up, go to your A5, down, down, then slide to your E5 in the first position, down, down, meet the strings, down, up, G5, down, down, meet the strings, down, up, F sharp 5, down, down, meet the strings, down, up, go to your A5, down, down, meet the strings, down, up, go to your B5, down, down, meet the strings, down, up, then go to your D sharp 5, down, down, then slide to your E5, down, then upstroke on the B5, then go to your E5 on first position. So, like this. Then meet the strings, down, up, G5, down, down, meet the strings, down, up, F sharp 5, down, down, meet the strings, down, up. Then go to your A5 and just do up, down, or down, up, down, up. Then go to your E5, down, down, with strings, down, up. G5, down, down, with strings, down, up. F sharp 5, down, down, with strings, down, up. A5, down, down, with strings, down, up. Then B5, down, down down up then go to your c sus2 then go one two three four down up down up down up down up and then after you've done that we're, it heads right back to the pre-chorus okay so let's play that slowly And for acoustic players, if you want to just make it a fuller sound, you just do full bar chords. Or you can just do uh, open, position, open position bar chords, or bar chords open. Experiment away with that. Then after the guitar solo, it's just going to head off uh, to the pre-chorus. So the first part's going to be the same with the A minor, B, and E minor, A, E minor, A, E minor. But on the second part, the strumming pattern is going to be different. So it's going to go like. So that's just the difference. So down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up. And that's the only change. Okay. And for the last chorus, it's going to be the exact same as the second chorus. And then on a CSS2, exact same way. One, two, three, four, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. And it's going to lead into the outro. So, and the outro is going to be the same as 
the rhythm over the guitar solo. E5, down, down, mute, down, up. G5, down, down, mute, down, up. F sharp 5, down, down, mute, down, up. A5, down, down, and back to E5, down, down, mute, down, up. G5, down, down, mute, down, up. F sharp 5, down, down, mute, down, up. A5, down, down, mute, down, up. B5, down, down, up, and end off on a C sus 2. And that's pretty much the end of the song right there. And if you put all those parts together, then you'll know how to play Beyond the Sun by Shine Down. Thanks for uh, putting up with my lesson, and I hope to catch you on the next one. And I hope you learned something. Sorry for the long wait, but life does happen. Hoping to reach a thousand subscribers, and hopefully you can make me reach that goal. Next video I'm uh, thinking about doing is Everlong by the Foo Fighters. Thank you, and thank you for watching, and take care.